It's a stressful time across the city of Dallas, and right now the environment of uncertainty has many renters and landlords on edge. We were hearing about housing issues and evictions well before COVID-19. Reverend Wes Helm is the Faith Information Manager for Faith in Texas, an organization that's been working with residents who've been burdened by housing costs. Since COVID-19 hit, of course, it's kind of stomped on the gas pedal for that. Helm says Faith in Texas is among advocates who've been discussing strategies to help keep individuals and families in their homes during this crisis, knowing many people haven't been working, money's not coming in, and bills are still due. You got to understand what it's like to get a notice to vacate, that even under normal conditions, it is so frightening to think, am I going to come home tomorrow and the locks are changed or my stuff's out on the curb? The Dallas City Council Ad Hoc Committee on COVID-19, Human and Social Recovery and Assistance took up the topic and the proposed landlord-tenant ordinance in a closed session on Thursday. We're going through some, some tough times. I think that goes without saying. It ultimately voted to approve sending a proposed landlord-tenant COVID-19 notice ordinance and action recommendations to the mayor. At the end of the day, I want what I think we all want is we want people to suffer less. We're all suffering to a certain extent. What's unclear is exactly what was approved in the landlord-tenant COVID-19 recommendations. The committee mentioned several attorneys provided guidance along with advocates on all sides. And while the proposed ordinance likely provides layers of protection for tenants, Helm isn't ignoring the impact on landlords. We want to say to landlords too, we see you too in the struggles that you are facing and how scary of a moment that this can be for you as well. The committee chair says the proposed landlord-tenant ordinance will be made public once the mayor's been notified. In Dallas, I'm Damon Fernandez.